All right, welcome back to Hot Topics TV. So somebody posted a picture that Rihanna put up on her Twitter page, right? And the caption alone got me to want to do this video. There's a divide between the Caribbean black community and the African-American black or African-American community in some ways, shapes and forms. There are a lot of us that like each other, but then there are a lot of us that see each other as so different and so foreign that we can't find common ground. So this particular comment, the DOS app posted says, so this is on at Rihanna's Twitter page, a photoshopped image of Martin Luther King with gold teeth in his mouth and a diamond earring. These foreigners have no respect for our culture. I will say for the 1000th time, they will use a foreigner in a film to play a bisexual Martin Luther King. That comment alone right there. In other words, then there's so much damage in just that comment alone. You're about to find out why they want Rihanna canceled. And it's bigger than about them wanting Rihanna canceled. That particular comment right there. These foreigners have no respect for our culture. Right away it's separating us. It's saying that Rihanna is foreign as in... She you know she's from Barbados. So these foreigners have no respect for our culture, meaning we're two different sets of people. You know what I mean? The funny thing is, I was raised in the US and I've been here since I was eight years old. And all throughout my growing up and to this day, everybody just assumes that I am a African American until we get into details about who I am. So you know what I mean? We still go through the same struggles living in the same place. And let's get into this topic. Okay, so Rana had this picture. And the picture got Martin Luther King on it with gold teeth. And a lot of people seem to be offended just because he's wearing gold teeth in the picture. They're kind of like making it seem as if she is degrading and disrespecting him. I've seen many of comments that said, leave our national heroes alone. Um, there is another one that says, this is so disrespectful and degrading. Martin Luther King would never put gold fronts in his mouth. And another one that said, only respectable people and respectful people would put that stuff in their mouth anyways. So why are you doing Martin Luther King like that? I put all these other pictures throughout this video just to have y'all think while you listen to what I'm saying. Majority of the people you see in these pictures are icons. Not just regular citizens, they are icons. They are stars. They have made themselves multi-millionaires off of their own talents and skills. Most of them highly talented, highly paid, and live a different kind of a lifestyle. You understand? With a whole bunch of gold teeth in their mouth, whether it's permanent or caps. And they have contributed greatly to this thing that this person calls our culture. With a mouthful of gold teeth. So a mouthful of gold teeth does not make you redundant or not worthy of value. Or it doesn't say you don't have anything to contribute. Anyhow... Rihanna caught some major heat from her fans on Martin Luther King Day for using a photoshopped image of Dr. Martin Luther King as her Twitter header. The altered image showed Dr. Martin Luther King with a mouthful of gold or a gold grill and some diamond earrings. Rihanna has been using the banner since last February and She's getting a lot of flack about it and she is refusing to change it. So now there's this, this whole movement of trying to get Rihanna to change the banner for Martin Luther King Day because we hate going over there and seeing him with a mouthful of gold teeth is becoming a movement. The photo sparked renewed outrage on Martin Luther King Day this year as it did last year. But you know, because COVID and all that was going on, nobody wasn't really paying attention to Martin Luther King Day. We weren't able to go outside and celebrate, be in a park, fire up the barbecue, spend time with the family and all that. We were busy masking up and staying six feet distance apart and all that other stuff. So wasn't that big of a rage. This year, place opened up a little bit. 
They're back on it again. Tell Rihanna to get that stuff down. As reported by a media house called Meow, one user tweeted and said, Dear Rihanna, this is disrespectful. Take it down. As a non-African American, you have no idea what this man meant to us. He gave his life for us. Hashtag MLK. Hashtag Martin Luther King Jr. As it, this person told Rihanna that this is disrespectful. And as a non-African American, you have no idea what this meant to us. Well, I see I have a theory about the African American stuff as well, right? Because check it. African American. Meaning, you are of African descent. But you are American. Whether it's naturalized or it was through birth, right? Okay. Do you know that America is not the United States of America? When they say America, we're talking of the continent. You have Asia, and then you have the Americas, and you have Europe. We're talking different continents, right? You have Africa, etc. So, the continent, Jamaica itself and other Caribbean islands are considered to be located in the Americas as well. So if we're going to say that we are Americans, then you got to separate it with black Americans versus this American, that American. Then we get all complicated. The title uh, African American was given to black people like in recent times, because before that you were something else, the Negro. And then you know, and other words and other phrases, and now we're African Americans. Okay, proud of your African ancestry, but you are an American by birth. Understood. However, to tell her that she has no idea what he means to you, then I think you need to go study the history of like Barbados and Jamaica and all these other Caribbean islands, and you will see. That that same history is closely intertwined with the history of our African American brothers and sisters. Quick example, Marcus Mosiah Garvey sparked the movement in the United States of America and other parts of the world. He was Jamaican. Now, another person commented and said, hey, Rihanna, could you change your banner? Because it doesn't show Martin Luther King in a good light. Per the report, a third user added, is Rihanna trying to get canceled today? Because that's what we'll do. Cancel her. Another fan noted. Hashtag, hashtag symbolis, symbolism matters. This is how at Rihanna honors Martin Luther King to 104.1 million followers. Are you serious? This is how she honors him to over 1 million or uh, 101.4. 104.1 million followers. I guess that's how many followers she has on that streaming platform. And they're upset because this is how you are portraying him to your audience. The person said, this screams no respect and it screams ignorance. And I'm so disappointed in Rihanna for this. Meanwhile, some of her fans didn't really agree with the backlash and started calling it fake outrage man like <laughs> everybody's walking around looking for something to be upset about today chill out chill with the cancel chill with the fake outrage there are more other pressing issues out there that we have to be concerned about other than rihanna putting up a picture of martin luther king with a mouthful of gold teeth and this constant comment of saying that people with gold teeth are like nobody's you're stereotyping your own self. One user tweeted, Folks been making club flyers for the last two decades in Martin Luther King Day and with the same kind of image. And now y'all want to get mad at Rihanna for posting that fake outrage is so real. Plus the picture is mad old. While another person said, I don't know why people mad at Rihanna for just because she have a picture of Martin Luther King with a grill in his teeth. But I don't see them going after other people that's posting up Martin Luther King with a do-rag on. Shaking my head. Keep doing your thing, Riri. I guess hate comes with the territory, right? Do you think, do you, 
who's listening to this right now think that Rihanna's Photoshop image of Martin Luther King is disrespectful to him? Leave your comments in the comments section below and let's talk about this. Let's talk about is it disrespectful? Let's talk about is there a underlined issue of division between the African American and the West Indian or Caribbean community? Because something like this shouldn't have brought out all those comments, all those hateful comments. Or maybe I'm just reaching and overreacting. Leave your comments in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about this one. I, for one, in my personal opinion, I don't see a reason to cancel her for that. And for two, which should be one, I don't think we can cancel her. She's gotten too big. Stay tuned. Got some other stuff coming up from Rihanna. Big moves that you just need to know about. I wish she would come on with the music though, because that's what we really fell in love with her for. And we haven't heard any music from Rihanna in God knows how long. She's doing big business with her Fenty line and other business ventures. But let's get to this music, Riri. I'll catch y'all on the next video. I'm out. Peace.